I know what happened to my shirt. I'm in the zone. Oh, I'm in the zone, man. Zone, man. Yeah. By all means, let the shirt stay in shirtland. All I know is I got this big ass, beautiful bottle of apple juice. No, look at it! Hi. Look at it! I don't need it. Oh, yeah. I don't need it today. Today I'm simple. Got the twist off bottle. I got the bottle I could take to the park and hang out all day. I got the bottle I could put in my backpack and sneak into a game. I got the bottle I could just open up without any problems. This is for the kid. Then 21 year old kid. That's what just makes life easy. Cause who's got a corkscrew? Just hanging around. Wine open. It's army night. Just lo and behold. But I got salmon and tacos to eat with today too. This taco so we got a feast about to happen. And what goes first? The food or the wine? Food, wine, food, wine, wine, of course. Barig, barig, famille, bao. I'm excited. Doesn't that just make life simple? I don't gotta ask. Why aren't they all twist off top? I need answers. I mean, I get it. Some people don't want to do the twist off top because they think that it takes away, takes away from the aging process. Oh my god. The aging process. I never had an aged body. I only get the young body. Well, if you go with the court, the chances are it hits better and the shield's better. It's all there for you. People are just trying to lessen the probability that the wine goes bad. Because <clears throat> they didn't make a good wine in the first place. Oh! I trust these people with the twist off top. <clears throat> believe in the product and believe it's supposed to be drank now. Live for the moment. Eat these tacos today. <clears throat> This bad boy's from our shit. And it already smells like a dry fruit. It's like apricot. It's like thin air, bitch. I said it. Apple juice. Smell just like apple juice too. This is a bottle of apple juice and so it is. It's Austrian. But you You said it the wrong way. But you eat wine. Oof. Felt like somebody was trying to squeeze a fart in my mouth. It came in really smooth. Then it said strangle you. Release. It's a little bit on the sweeter side. A little bit. Apricots. This tastes like 7-Up. This tastes like by 7-Up with a hint of orange. Hidden in the back. Mmm. This tastes like pre gamer because it's so smooth. It's so lighthearted. That's the type of wine when you drink. That's a day drinker. That's the type of wine you drink when you just got out the gym. No beer, but give me some bread. Give me some bread and make it real quick. Food's ready. I got motherfucking salmon. I got salmon, but I think it's too dry. It's like a fucking rock. Oh well. I'm full of sweet when I'm making the salmon. It tastes dry. It tastes really good because I'm an expert at seasoning. It tastes like gum. Thanks to the bridge, my salmon. And potatoes seem to keep tasting better and better and better with every sip of that. That's the bottle you take when you gotta go to your auntie's house. And you know your auntie can't cook, you gotta eat her food. Cause that. Remember one time my mom made us go to this lady's house to eat? Nobody wanted to eat the food. I'm stuffing food in my napkin. Take it outside with me so I can throw it in the trash later. Had I thought about it, I could have drank this down that food without a problem. Although I get it, some people pull it so nasty that you need something strong. You need something strong, strong, strong. This 12.5%, that's strong. Ooh, it tastes different when you drink from the bottle when you drink it in the cup. I don't think it's meant to be drank like that. It's not meant for you to throw it back and chug it. I think the real reason people drink warm is because you gotta drink it slow. So it's cheaper. She won't get out. She won't get out. Somebody was thinking that. Hey, we was saying that money. Drink it up. Keep your head up. Seven up. Gotta keep your head up. I just became a bad always here. I can't drink wine. It's not strong enough. I don't feel anything from it. Cause you don't have any taste bud and your body is broken. I'm about to finish one glass and I feel it and I taste it and I appreciate it. Lack of appreciation is why you can't feel nothing. Oh, it's got a tingly little aftertaste. It tastes like a Riesling at the end where it feels a little, little on the sweeter side. A little sour candy-ish. You know how I fuck with the rig? It's a mix. It's got a little variety. It's like 50% gruner, 50% broke tea. It's a little mix, baby. You know what I'm saying? I got a little mixing in my blood. And that's why we mix well together. So that's facts. If you mix, you drink mixed wine. And if you not, then you drink 100%. Ancestry.com. Oh yeah, that rope tear. That rope tear. Look like a spilled rotor. Rotor. The best white grape you can get. I heard it through the grapevine. <laughs> the Gruner grape? What kind of name is Gruner? Probably what makes it taste so sour. It's like green grape. Nobody likes green grape. Everybody eats the red grapes. Shit don't even make no sense. But you make an exception. The people who make this wine they seem like pretty good people. They look like a family full of second grade teachers. <laughs>